on today's video guys i'm just going to be going over how to freeze the christmas mask in the dm glitch so it's going to be the same as uh, the video i uploaded like a few days ago but to get it started make sure in single player you've eaten a bird peyote it doesn't matter which bird as long as it's not the chicken once you've eaten the bird peyote instead of single player you shouldn't have to do it again so from there just go ahead and come online once you come online just go ahead and make your outfit that has a forage facing cap and a parachute on it doesn't have to be the same as mine just go ahead and make whatever outfit and put on a forward facing cap and a parachute once you got the forward facing cap and parachute on your character open up your interaction menu go to your spawn location and set it to last location once you've got that you want to go ahead and open up your map and look for where the time trial is at so for this week the time trial is over here depending on what time you see the video it may be somewhere else it doesn't matter just make your way over to the time trial also, be sure not to use the RC Bandito time trial or that's not going to work. And also with the DM glitch, you do not lose all your outfits. So you get to keep all your outfits. I'm just going to show you guys real quick. As you guys can see, I still got all my other outfits. So here we go. I still got all of them. So with the DM glitch, you're going to get to keep all your outfits. You're not going to lose any of your outfits at all. So once you've got your forward facing cap and the parachute on your outfit, just go ahead and come to the time trial, wherever it is. Go up to it. You're going to hit right on the D-pad to start it. Once you start it, hold down on the D-pad and switch to any story mode character. All right, so once inside of story mode, you're gonna hold your interaction button or open up your interaction menu, my bad. Just go ahead and open up your interaction menu and go inside of director mode. Once you guys are in director mode, go to your shortlist actors and just hit either Y or triangle to remove all your shortlist actors. Once you got that, you're gonna go to actors, go to animals, and you're going to shortlist your bird so hit either Y or triangle to shortlist your bird that you're going to be using once you've got that you're going to back out go to online characters and you're going to hit either Y or triangle to shortlist whichever character you're going to be using so once you've shortlisted whatever character you're going to be using just go ahead and back out and exit to story mode Once you guys get loaded inside of story mode, just go ahead and open up your interaction menu again and just go back into director mode. Once you're back inside director mode, go to shortlist actors. And from here, you're going to get a rubber band and put it on your controller because you want to go between your online character and your bird for about 30 to 35 minutes. And what you see happening is your bird start duplicating. So just get a rubber band and put it on your controller for about 30 to 35 minutes. If you don't have a rubber band, just find a way to um, hold your L-stick down or just put something on it or put your controller upside down. I'm not sure. Just do whatever you got to do to um, make the uh, thing go in between your bird and your online character. And you're going to leave this for about 30 to 35 minutes. And what you're looking for is your online character to go on top of your haystack. So once the online character goes on top of the haystack, you're going to go ahead and take the rubber band off your controller. So I'm going to be back when our online character is on top of the haystack. So as you guys can see right here, my character is on top of the haystack. So from here, just go ahead and take the rubber band off your controller. Once you take the rubber band off your controller, just go ahead and go back, go to actors. And from here, you can use most of these categories. I only stick to beach bumps and emergency services, but it's up to you which one you're going to choose. 
once you choose the category that you're going to be using when you get inside of here you're going to hit either square or x to change the appearance and you can use most of these options you have to use only one but just hit either square or x to change the appearance if your character turns into a regular npc all you got to do is go back to shortlist actors and go between your online character for about a few seconds and your online character should go back on the haystack that's for if your character turned into a regular npc but if your character doesn't turn into a regular npc and you're able to just go through the outfits what you're looking for now is an outfit that has a christmas mask on it and it can't have more than one christmas component on it so if it has a christmas um, christmas mask and a christmas sweater it's not gonna work if it has like a christmas mask and christmas pants it's also not gonna work it needs to have only a christmas mask on it so i'm going to quickly go ahead and find an outfit that has only a christmas mask on it and once you guys find that outfit you're going to hit either y or triangle to shortlist it so i'm going to be back when we find an outfit that has a christmas mask on it all right so as you guys can see i've gone ahead and found me an outfit that has a christmas mask on it once you find the outfit that you're going to be using that got the christmas mask on it you're going to hit either Y or triangle to shortlist it. Once you've shortlisted it, you're just going to go ahead and go back to your shortlist actors. And from here, you're going to go ahead and remove your online character and your bird. So hit either Y or triangle to remove your online character and your bird. Once you move your online character and your bird and your outfit isn't showing like this, you're just going to go back, go to actors, go to whichever category. Um, it doesn't really matter. And your outfit should show. If your outfit still isn't showing, you're just going to hit um, either square or X to go through the outfits and the outfit should, should start showing. But now to um, save, not save, but now to freeze the Christmas mask, all you're going to do is go to shortlist actors. Once you're over here, you're just going to go back, go to actors, go to whichever category you're going to be using and hit either X or square to change outfits. And you got to repeat this a couple of times to um, freeze the Christmas mask. So all you got to do is go to shortlist actors. Go to actors, whichever category you're going to be using, and hit either X or square. So right now I'm hitting X and square and my outfit isn't changing. If your outfit isn't changing, if you're hitting X or square, just go to a different option and hit X or square and the outfit should change. So just repeat that process. Usually it takes me about um, 15 to 30 minutes to freeze the mask. So that's all you're going to be doing. Just keep on repeating it. Just go to shortlist actors, go to actors, whichever category, and just hit either square or X to change the appearance. I'm just going to do this a couple of times just in case you still don't get it. So that's all you're going to be doing. Go to shortlist actors, stay here for a little bit, go to actors, whichever category you're going to be using and just hit either X or square to switch outfits. And if you hit it, the Christmas mask is going to freeze on all the outfits and you're going to be able to take almost every single outfit online. So I'm just going to do this for a little bit more and then I'm going to um, cut it to when I'm able to freeze the uh, Christmas mask. All right, so as you guys can see, I've gone ahead and froze the Christmas mask and I just went past the orange joggers by accident, but we could just get that easily online. But yeah, I've gone ahead and froze the Christmas mask. So from here, I can take almost any outfit that I want online. And remember, like I said earlier, you cannot take an outfit that has more than one Christmas component on it. So since the outfit already has a Christmas mask on it, if it has a Christmas pants or like Christmas sweater on it or Christmas gloves, it's not gonna work. It needs to have only the Christmas mask on it. And now freezing this Christmas mask, it took me about 30, let me check the time real quick. I think like 36 minutes, but it's not really that hard. So once you find your outfit that you want to take online, you're going to hit either Y or triangle to shortlist it. So I'm not really looking for anything um, special right now. I'm just trying to look for a quick outfit that I'm going to take online because I'm probably not even going to save it. But 
once I find the outfit, I'm gonna be back with you guys. And like I said, once you find the outfit you wanna take online, hit either Y or triangle to shortlist it. All right, so I came across this outfit right here and I'm just calling it right now. I don't think this is gonna work because of the um, torso and the arms, but I'm still gonna try it anyway. So once you guys find the outfit that you wanna take online, just hit either triangle or Y to shortlist it. Once you shortlist it, you're gonna go back to your shortlist actors. Oh, fuck. Excuse me, I just burped. Once you get back to your shortlist actor, just go ahead and select the outfit that you wanted to take online. So you can shortlist a whole bunch of them, but in the end, you're only gonna be able to take one outfit online. So I'm gonna be trying this outfit right here. And like I said, I don't think it's gonna work, but I'm gonna try it anyway. So once you're inside your shortlist actor, just go ahead and select the outfit that you're gonna be taking online and take it inside director mode. So once you guys are inside of director mode from here, you're just gonna wait in here for about 15 or 20 seconds. You can walk around, run around, just stand still, doesn't matter. Just wait in here for about 15 or 20 seconds. All right, so once you think it's been long enough, from here, you're just gonna hold down on the D-pad and switch to a story mode character. If you get this alert, just go ahead and accept it. Once you guys get inside of single player, you're also gonna wait in here for about another 15 to 20 seconds. So I'm just gonna run around for a few seconds. And then after you waited in here for long enough, you're just gonna hit your pause button, go to online, go to play GTA online, and just go inside of a invite only session. So I'm just gonna wait in here for like a, just a few seconds, not that long. All right, so once you think it's been long enough, just go ahead and hit your pause button go to online, go to play GTA online, just go inside of an invite only session. All right, so once you guys get online, as you can see, I got my outfit. I <laughs> I don't think I'm actually gonna save this. But once you guys get online with your um, outfit, you can go ahead and make your way over to the clothing store and go ahead and go save the outfit. So this, I don't think I'm gonna save, but once you guys do spawn in with your um, outfit, just go to the clothing store and go save it. So as you guys can see, the... um. The DM glitch is still working. You can freeze the Christmas mask and all that. You don't have to use only the red stocking and the Krampus mask. You can use almost any of the um, Christmas mask. So that's gonna be it for today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed And if you did, don't forget to drop a like on it, share it and subscribe. And don't forget to turn your post notifications on so you don't miss out on future videos. So down in the comment section, I better not see any comments saying the glitch is not working. If it's not working, you're probably doing something wrong because I just did it and um, it's 100% still working. And so yeah, that's going to be it.